Hey guys, today we're going to show you how to clean your C drive with local disk C on Windows 10. It's a simple procedure but very effective and we're gonna show it as fast as possible. We're not using any third party program to perform this cleaning process so you don't have to download another creepy tool to do this. For your information, cleaning the unwanted file from your C drive will make your Windows run much faster. So let's start. Step number one, cleaning. Go to start button and right click on it. Now choose run from here. Now enter temp and click on ok. Now you'll see all these files and folders which are not needed and it's created only for a temporary purpose. So you can select all of them now. Click on shift plus delete on your keyboard. Some file may be undeletable so ignore them and delete the rest. Now we have to open the run box again and this time type in percentage temp percentage. Click on OK and another folder will appear. As same as we dealt with the last temp folder, continue deleting all the file. Once you do that you have to open the run box for the final time. And this time, type in prefetch. Now you'll see another folder open. And maybe it asks you for the permission to access the files. In that case, click on continue. And the files and folders will be revealed to you. Now do the same thing you did with the last two folders. Select all and hit shift plus delete and that's it. Step number 2. Recycle bin. You may know this already but we have to tell you this because a majority of people are unaware of this. Whenever you delete a file by right click delete option or hitting the delete key on your keyboard, it will not remove the files from your computer. It will keep all the deleted files on your recycle bin until a certain limit and the default Windows 10 recycle bin limit is somewhere around 50 GBs. Yes, you can hit the shift plus delete key to delete a file from your computer completely but what if you forget to do so? For your information, the recycle bin is using your C drive space. So technically if you delete something without hitting the shift plus delete, it will eventually end up somewhere in your C drive or system drive which will cause your system go slow. So if you didn't clean up your recycle bin frequently, it will acquire a good amount of space out of your C drive. So let's delete all of the files from the recycle bin as well and hope you do this once in a while. At this point, you'll see improvements on your C drive space. But wait, it's not done yet. We can do a few more things, maybe better than what you saw in the previous steps. Step number 3. Uninstall. In this step, we're gonna show you how to uninstall all the unwanted or rarely using software or programs from your computer, which is basically installed into your C drive by default. So, by removing those unwanted programs, you can get a lot more space on your C drive. For that, you need to go to Start menu and search Add or Remove Programs. So, click on it. Now, it will open the Windows Settings app and Feature window. So, come down and uninstall each and every rarely using or unwanted programs. It's just a matter of clicking the uninstall button and follow the on-screen instructions. Step number 4. Optimize. First, you need to go to your This PC or File Explorer. Now, go to the C drive. Right click and choose properties. From here, go to the tools tab and click on the optimize option under the optimize and defragment drive section. Now you'll see this wing too, so make sure you have selected your C drive from here. Once you do that, come down here and click on the optimize button once again. Step number 5. Disk cleanup. This is the last and final step that I know to clean your C drive even more or to ensure everything else unwanted are clean from your C drive. To do this, you need to go to your start menu and search disk cleanup. Now 
Now you'll see it in the result, so click on it. It will perform a quick scan of your drive and shows you this window. Once you're here, check each and every option and click on Clean up system files. It performs a deep scan. Once it is finished, it will open this new window, the same as we dealt in the previous windows. Just select each and every option from here as well. Now click OK and delete files. The cleanup process may take a while, so let it finish. That's all we can do to clean up your C drive. Hope you're experiencing a performance boost, free up space and a more enhanced system responsiveness. So that's all for today. Leave a like if you liked and subscribe if you loved. See you soon with another video.